Hey, what are you picking? What do you pick? Flowers? Is it for tea? Yeah? No? <laughs> How do you eat this though? You don't eat it? Oh, so it's for making those uh, those things around the head. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's pretty good. So it has good smell. Mm. Yeah, it's nice. It's good. So you make some of those flower uh, things for the head. That's nice. School bus. The two kids went off to school. Just hold it. I'll be on this side. Alright, so this morning the little boy climbed up to the coconut tree and he got three coconuts. So the first one didn't have so much water, but the second one did, and then the third one has a lot of water. So I'm just drinking breakfast here. A lot of water in this one. Afterwards, uh, we'll scoop it out with the spoon. All right, good. <laughs> I take those for. All right. It's my uh, Samoan dress right here. Got the. Uh, I got this at the um, Apia. Apia from. Yeah, Apia. Nice. Hey, so how do you make it? You just connect them up? Yeah. Oh, really? Just put a hole like the end here. And oh, really? Insert one of the mm, okay. small one. Uh, mm. So you're a professional. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so you put the little ball in between the two yeah. stem, mm -mm. and you make the hole in the stem. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I see it. No, the ball goes in between the hole of the stem. And this is the finished product, huh? It's nice. Yep. <laughs> Flower. Petau. Petau. Mm, okay. I'm wearing a fatau. There's uh, <laughs> so <colored>. yeah. <laughs> so I went right into town. <laughs> Six pieces of flour that they put together, and they get it from this tree. This is the tree they get it from. Fetau is the name. We're gonna go into town now on the moped. I have a head uh, thing on your head too. I don't know, what do you call that? Fau. Fau? Yeah. And what about mine? Yeah, same. Same? Yeah. Fau. Fau. Oh, okay, that's nice. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, you made that from local flowers here? Yeah. Oh, okay. That's pretty good. All right, what kind of food do we have? That's pie, pie sausage. Pie, sausage. A local frying pan, uh, pancake. Pancake, egg. egg. Cake, Cake, samosa, and so on. Oh, okay. Which one's this one? Roti. Roti? This one? Uh, local pancake. Same like that? Yes. So there's no meat in this one, right? No. Oh, okay. Have that's, some? That's pretty good. Maybe I'll try some of the local um, yeah. pancake one. Here's the plans for the community hall that's going to be built here. And here it is. The 
big community hall that they're building right now. It's almost going to be finished. In two more months, it'll be finished. They say it's going to be finished by September. Hey, look this way. All right, that's good. <laughs> so this place will be finished in September? Yeah. About? So two more months, it's almost finished. Yeah. All right, good. We're uh, visiting around the island, and um, I met you. What was your name? My name is uh, uh, Reverend Tofinga Falani. Ah, okay. So you stopped by to see the uh, project over oh, here. that's good. That's good. They say it's going to be finished yeah. soon. Yeah, very, very soon. Well, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Jason. I'll see you around. See you around. Take care. Here's the local traffic. Hey doggy, how are you? Doing okay? Here comes the motorcycles. to Lofa Sports Center. I wanted to take a look at your sports center. So what time do you open? It's open. No, but what time do you open? Like six o'clock. Six o'clock? And you're open on what time? 6 p.m.? Oh, okay, so 12 hours. Oh, okay. So you have all kinds of sports. Oh, but the thread mills are not working. Are those working? On to the back? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Use for the gym here? So one dollar. Per, per hour? So one dollar per hour, you can use this anytime. Uh, between 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Okay, it's good service. <laughs> Rest in peace, bro. This grave site has a house on top of it. In fact, they even locked the door and they put wire on its uh, windows. Bulldozer that just a scrap of metal now and it's all rusted over. So here's the port with the ships here. And the water is super clean. You can even see down below. And that's the southern part of the island down that way. The main road goes right through the middle of this um, area. Love making ladders to get up to the coconut tree. So if you look over here, you can see the ladder to reach the coconut tree. This is another grave site, believe it or not. You look inside and you can see the coffins. This looks to be an old jeepney they left behind. You again. Here's a get better view from this side. This is against the sun, but here's another view. They love hammocks around here. I see them everywhere. Hey puppies. <laughs> Look at all these puppies. Here's those ladders. It's so small here. Let it go 
Here's a bigger hammock. There's the house. And there's a cemetery for one of the people. Well, it should have taken me a while to get to the northern end of this island. But I keep walking. I've been here yesterday with the moped a lot quicker. But I think I'm almost there. Hi, guys. Hi. <laughs> All right, so what are you eating for breakfast? Pulaka, we call it pulaka. What is pulaka? Just like taro. Hello? Taro. 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 Yeah. Oh, taro root. But oh, this okay. One is growing here. It taro. grows here? Yeah. Mm, okay. So, taro, uh, what else? Uh, rice? Rice and tin fish. <laughs> <laughs> tin fish? Oh, from a tin can? Yeah, from the tin can. Oh, yeah. okay. It's not fresh. <laughs> not fresh, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, this is the. What is this one? <coughs> Red fruit? <coughs> yeah. And this one? That is bulaka. Oh, bulaka. This is the taro. Yeah, but oh. it's different. Hmm? It's different? Yeah. Oh, it's different than um, taro. Yeah. But it grows here. Yeah, it grows. Bulaka. Bulaka. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Yeah. So is this the grave site right here? Yeah. Ah. Oh, okay. The board is the pillow and what's the stone for? Massage. For massage. Massage? Yeah. For your stomach? Stomach or oh, the back. Oh, the back too. Oh, okay. That's pretty good. Here's the causeway. And here's the really nice clear water. This side is really wavy. And this side is really calm. This is a good place to go snorkeling. This area has a nice landscape. Oh, well, here's a piggo. Hey, piggy. Piggy's curious. He's in his pig pen. Hey, pig. Are you doing okay? Are you scared? Wow, it's really colorful here. I'm surprised. There's another big hammock. This is how jungle looks like. Pandanas and coconut. So I'm almost to the end of this road. It should take me another 20 minutes, possibly. It took me three hours, basically, from town. And I'm almost there. There are hammocks here. I see hammocks everywhere. Pretty much every house that is in Tuvalu has a hammock. hammocks are made from fishing net and then some sort of pole here it's not it's not uh, hard to make this is that odd end pole that they use this house is where all the piggies live hey piggies got all kinds of them black white pink brown well you guys are curious now huh Here's another one. Come on, there's a brown one. Hey, piggy. So the piggies get to have this view next to their uh, pig pen. And here's their pig pen. So you got squash, papaya. You grow vegetables and fruits in your backyard? Yeah. So what exactly do you grow? Um, we grow pumpkins. Pumpkins. Um, sweet potatoes. Sweet potatoes. Um, taro. Taro. Cabbages. Oh, okay. And, and popo. Popo. What about bananas? Yeah, we grow bananas. Oh, really? Okay, that's nice. So that's a lot of stuff. So the prisoners stop by to pick up some food? Yeah. <laughs> they came to buy some pumpkin. And oh, really? Popo. Oh, you have tomatoes too? It's Oh, over here. Oh, it's not yet ready. Yeah. Mm -hmm, okay. Uh, we have, we have, um, what do you mean? Like maize? Yeah. So that's a main tree. 
Oh, May. But what is May? Um, um, is it like corn? No? You know when you go to the village and it's like tree? A... Yeah. May. May. But you can eat May? Yes. Oh, really? So, Popo. Oh, you have ducks too. Hey, ducks. <laughs> so, this is your family farm. So, how do you sell your fruit? Do you go into the village to sell it? Um, or? Yeah, sometimes I used to go to the market oh, on okay. Sundays and Saturdays. Sundays? Saturdays. Saturdays. That's today. Pardon? That's today. Today is Friday. Oh, tomorrow, okay. <laughs> Friday to today, you know. Okay, my, uh, Monday to Friday, and be my house. Oh, really? Okay. Pumpkin. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> hey, do you call pumpkin also squash? It's different. You don't grow it's, squash. We do. That's a small one, eh? Oh, the small one is a squash. Um, I squash pumpkin squash. I can't even call it. Pumpkin squash, you know. It's small. I know it's too small, but in the end, you know, we Ah, okay. okay. People, yeah. My big, yeah. My big one, the one we need for big one. They yeah. Like big one. What's this for? Um, so the truck went past and they had something, so my dad's using it for fertilizer. Okay, so there's all your pumpkins. They're $25, some of them? Yeah. Ah, and some are 15 mm -hmm. Oh, okay, that's nice. Cecilia. Cecilia. So where were you born? In Tonga. In Tonga. So you're half Tongan and half Tuvaluan. Can you speak uh, both Tongan and Tuvaluan? Yes. Wow, that's pretty good. It's <laughs> a good skill. <laughs> it took me exactly three hours to reach the end here in the northern part of the island. So I made it back to the dump. That was uh, from 7.30 a.m. until 10.30 a.m. right now. It was a nice tour. I saw many things. Oh, this is pretty nice. Well, this is a pretty nice picturesque view right here. This is the northern end of the island. It's past the dumpster and the dump, so there's nobody really here. I'm almost at the end too. Got here, but we're almost at the end. Wow, and this is it. All the way at the northern tip. You can't go any further, unless the tide gets low, I guess. Definitely more wavy on the right side. So that's nice, I made it here. It took me a while. Alright, here I am in the island of Funafuti, the country of Tuvalu, which is my 180th country in the world. And now I have 16 countries left to go. I went all the way to the northern part of this island, past the dump, and I continue dancing around the world. Alright, here I am in the island of Funafuti, the country of Tuvalu, which is my 180th country. I got 16 more countries left to visit. On this tour, I've been uh, stopping in American Samoa, Samoa, Tonga, Fiji, and then I came to Tuvalu. And next, I'm hoping to visit Kiribati. So, really nice island right here. It takes 28 minutes to go from north to south by moped. But if you walk it, of course, it'll take maybe four hours. Really enjoying this place. And I'm really happy to make it to the South Pacific. Here's some civilization. A speedboat. 
Wow, this water is incredible. I'm on a deserted island in the South Pacific where there's no one around. That's the kind of introduction you could have to this location. Because right behind me, there's nobody here. It's pretty secluded. From this vantage point, you can see the entire island of Funafuti. I basically crossed this whole area all the way to the end. Right. There's a boat. All the way to this end, right there. And I'm actually staying at that end in that house. Your name? Kine. Kenny? Kine. Kine. Okay, where are we going? Back to town? Oh, okay. <laughs> where? Kiribati. Yeah, Kiribati next. Here's the Seventh day Adventist church. Here's the Seventh day Adventist primary school as well. Here's the bananas. So here's the price of the lodge. $50 for locals and $90 for overseas guests. Fine. Great. Uh, what's your name? Nang. Nang? Nang Ho. Oh, Nang Ho. Yeah. Oh, okay. I see Nang Shop, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's good. So how old are you? Uh, 27. 27 now? Yeah. Oh, okay. So your parents used to own this shop before? Before, yeah. And then they moved back to China? Yeah. Uh, what city in China? Guangdong. Uh, Guangdong? Yeah. Oh, that's near uh, Hong Kong? Yeah. Oh, okay. That's pretty good. So you grew up in uh, Tuvalu, right? Yeah. But you were born over there or here? Born in China. Guangdong. You're born in China. In Guangdong also? Yeah. Oh, that's good. So then um, Lapua Lapua told me that you grew up here since age 8, right? Yeah. So you've been living here almost 20 years. Yeah. Wow, so you almost know everything about Tuvalu. Yeah, yeah. It's such a small island. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's good. Where's your brother now? He's in China. He's in China right now? Yeah, yeah. So it's only you right now? Yeah, only myself. Yeah. Oh, okay. When is your brother coming? Maybe next month. Next month? Yeah. Oh, okay. And then you'll switch? Maybe. Maybe. Maybe stay in the place. Oh, okay. How long will you go for? Three months. Three months at yeah. a time? Yeah. Oh, okay. That's good. So what do you sell here? Like all kinds of stuff, yeah? Clothes, backpacks. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, okay. Oh, you're doing really fancy ones. <laughs> Started. Oh, okay. Yeah. This supermarket is called J Y Ocean. Wow, it's so easy. <laughs> mm, okay. That's it? That's it. This is the government building and here is the Funafuti Lagoon Hotel.
stopping by here at the hotel. What's the name of the hotel, guys? Funafuti Lagoon Hotel. Yeah, Funafuti Lagoon Hotel. It's one of the major hotels. So behind there is where the delegates are coming next August, right? Or is it this August? Next August. 2019? Yeah, correct. Oh, okay. So you guys are passing through uh, Tuvalu for a few days? We're here for work. We're oh, okay. We're doing work uh, with the Australian government for a new Australian High Commission oh, okay. in uh, Tuvalu. Um, and uh, obviously we're just on a, uh, an exercise at this stage to assess the viability of actually getting the building underway. So when do you think they will um, build a building? The intention was I wanted to have it ready by the end of this year in 2018. Hmm, okay. But it leaves a fairly short time frame though. Yeah, okay. Hopefully they manage. <laughs> yeah. What's your name? Rex. You're Rex? You? Anthony. Anthony and? And you day. You day? Yep. Okay, nice to meet you guys. Thank you. All right, I'm gonna continue my uh, tour around the island. <laughs> Funafuti Lagoon Hotel. The cost of the hotel is $115 per night on the bottom floor or $130, so that's $15 more for the top floor. And this is Australian dollars. I like your flowers. <laughs> Hey doggy. Here's a small housing development of eight houses. They look pretty secure. This is the fat tire bicycle. I'm surprised he has it here because normally it costs $3,000. Good. <laughs> What's your name? I'm like that. Uh, what? I'm like that. Like that. Like that. You don't know how to pronounce it? I know. Okay. Um. Like <laughs> that. Like that. And your name? Fangaseli. Fangaseli. Oh, okay. So you just uh, finish school or you have lunch? Um, lunch just finished and you're out here researching, looking for bottom. Oh, what are you looking for? Basically information on our topic. Oh, what's your topic? Tourism. Tourism? Yeah. Okay, so you have a questionnaire that you... Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> give me one. We will give you one. <laughs> okay, so I just fill it out? Yes, you just fill it out. But there's not many tourists in Tuvalu, yeah, right? Yeah, not real. It's about developing tourism in Tuvalu. Oh, really? That's our project. Mm, okay. Well, I can fill it out for you. Here's the Jehovah's Witness place. And uh, food just came in. Raw sugar, juices, all kinds of stuff for the supermarkets. Alright. I'm Jason. I'm Victoria. Victoria? It's my English name. Ah, I'll look at a video then. Hey Victoria. Hi. <laughs> so we're getting a ride. Where are you going right now? I'm going home to drop off the Oh okay. How many minutes is your home? Maybe uh, five. Five minutes? Yes. Okay, it's good. Halfway there for me. Oh. Darwin traditional game. Oh really? It's nice. So they're building a new house for him, huh? This is the governor's house. Oh, okay. They are building the house for next year for the forum. Ah, oh, okay. So this is the prime minister's house. Yes. Oh, okay, that's nice. So it's just so small. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So the Prime Minister lives here and they're fixing a car right here. 
And over here is the tanks for the rain. And then over here is the community hall for events. So this is where he lives. But he's off island today and this week he comes back later. Well, wow, there's a lot of coconuts here. And here's the lagoon. All right, that's nice. Governor's house here. Okay. Do you on, have on your face? What's uh, it say? Nikolain. Nikolain? Yeah. But uh, you do that here in Tuvalu? Yeah. Oh, really? Someone did it for you. Oh, that's yeah. interesting. <laughs> primary school and we're trying to do some local traditional dances here. So they have this team, two teams here, a couple teams there.
chalkboard actually. And the tables over there. The other room. What's your name? Tyler. Tyler, I'm Jason. Nice, nice to meet, to meet you. you, Jason. So, where are you from? I'm from Oregon. Oregon. And what are you doing in Tupelo? I'm installing a passenger boarding ramp for the airport. Oh, really? And how long did it take? Uh, it didn't take very long. It was about 45 minutes to do the installation and then oh. about 20 minutes to train. And you did that yesterday or this morning? Uh, I did that yesterday. Oh, okay. So, everyone's trained up. Yeah, everybody's trained and ready to go. All right, good. And what's your next destination? Uh, my next destination is going to be Samoa. Samoa. Yeah. So, you leave tomorrow. And then tomorrow's Saturday, and then on Sunday you leave to Samoa, yes, Apia. Yes, and you'll be there just like a day or two, yeah? Uh, two days. Two days? Wow, that's a great job. Yeah, it's, it's pretty you fun. You must love being a welder. I do, I do. Alright, great. Well, nice to meet you. It was nice meeting you too, Jason. Alright. Here's the town council. Yeah. University of South Pacific Tuvalu campus. Alright, so uh, I'm surprised to find the mosque at Tuvalu. Yeah. How many people attend here? Uh, like today, uh, about five or four people came. Five or four, but how many Muslims are in Tuvalu? Uh, about 70 or 80. 70 or 80, okay. Yeah. So my name is Jason, your name? Firdos. Firdos. Yeah. Firdos. Yeah. And where are you from? Uh, Jakarta, Indonesia. Oh, really? Wow, yeah. okay. Well, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah, take care. Yeah. <laughs> 